representing Yah. Exposing the Word Network, the Urban Religious Channel. Why are so many ministries and Christian singers on the Word Network flashing the Illuminati sign? Is it a prerequisite for being on this broadcast or what? The Illuminati means the enlightened ones. It's peculiar that the word network has a sun as their logo. I'm just saying. Why are so many ministers and Christian singers following the world in their allegiance to the Illuminati? Many of your popular Christian leaders are leading many innocent people to the slaughter while making merchandise out of them. There is a new world order coming and many of your popular Christian leaders are partners in crime with the Illuminati. This they do all for that almighty dollar. Wake up, people. Pay attention to your leaders. Judas Iscariot betrayed Jesus with a kiss, and many ministers are betraying Jesus with a flash. And it's going to cost you the entire farm, your corned beef, and your hash. flashing their image of a deity while they boldly preach and sing to you, paying homage to the Illuminati, sold out preachers and Christian singers on world view. God told me to cry aloud and spare not. Lift up your voice like a trumpet. Show my people their transgression and the house of Jacob their sins. So here I go. Here is Pastor Winston flashing the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign. Over and over again. The Judas Kiss. Here is Vicki Winans popping through a pyramid symbol, the Illuminati sign. Here we have Dr. Michael A. Freeman flashing the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign, the Judas Kiss. Here we have Dr. Todd Coons flashing the pyramid sign over and over and over and over again a Illuminati sign. You cannot serve two masters, God and money. What many in the church have sold out to is a religious spirit and dollars set up by the Illuminati. Here is a International Fellowship of Christians and Jews flashing the pyramid, the Illuminati sign. Here we have the late Bishop Gilbert Earl Patterson flashing the pyramid sign. Over and over again, the Judas kiss. Bishop Patterson seemed to have had a great allegiance to the Illuminati, for he has placed his entire congregation sitting in the formation of pyramids. I wonder who was allowed to sit in the first pinnacle seat of the pyramid.
Evangelist Louise Patterson, flashing the pyramid sign. Here we have Dr. Leroy Thompson, flashing the pyramid sign over and over again, the Judas kiss. Years later, he is still flashing the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign, over and over and over and over again. Here we have Reverend Timothy Fleming flashing the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign, over and over again while singing his country camp songs, The Judas Kiss. Here we have Pastor Oren Holmes flashing the pyramid sign, The Judas Kiss. Here we have Prophetess Medina Pullins flashing the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign, the Judas Kiss. Here is Prophet Demetrius Synagogue flashing the pyramid, the Illuminati sign. He is speaking with Prophetess Medina Pullins. He holds it steady while Medina talks away. Rock steady, Prophet Synagogue, the Judas Kiss. Here we have Minister Tyrone Dale Walker flashing the pyramid sign, the Judas Kiss. Here is Lyle and Deborah Dukes. Deborah flashes the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign. You cannot serve two masters, God and money. What many in the church have sold out to is a religious spirit and dollars set up by the Illuminati. Here is Pastor Charles Calvin flashing the pyramid sign over and over again. The Illuminati sign, the Judas kiss. Juanita Bynum. We have Juanita Bynum flashing the pyramid sign. And even when she bends and pulls, she does not lose focus of her pyramid, a Illuminati yo-yo. Juanita can be found throughout the seasons, spreading cheers and gladness and her pyramid allegiance, the Judas Kiss. Minister Norris Rowe from Amen Somebody Television Ministry, flashing the pyramid sign over and over again, the Judas Kiss. the pastor of Parkview Christian Center, flashing the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign. Here is Dr. Takeda Williams, flashing the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign. Over and, over and, over again, the Judas kiss. Here is Bishop Bloomer flashing the pyramid sign, the Illuminati sign. Here's Benny Hinn flashing the pyramid, the Illuminati sign. Here we have Brothers of the Word Ministry flashing the pyramid, the Illuminati sign. Over and over again, the Judas kiss. Here is Joyce Meyer, flashing the pyramid, 
the Illuminati sign. Here we have prophetess Christina Glenn flashing the pyramid, the Illuminati sign, over and over again, the Judas kiss. I call this sign eye candy because not only are you a trick and treat when you eat, your eyes are now wide open because you purposely kiss at Satan's feet. The Judas Kiss. Here's Gilbert flashing his eye candy, the Illuminati sign, using both hands. The Judas Kiss. Juanita Bynum flashing her eye candy, the Illuminati sign. The Judas Kiss. Here we have prophetess Christina Glenn flashing her eye candy, the Illuminati sign. Rock steady, Christina. She holds her eye candy pose like a ballerina. The Judas Kiss. Here is Pastor E. Chris Hill of the Potter's House in Denver, flashing his eye candy, the Illuminati sign. Here is the Potter's House logo. It is in the shape of an upside down pyramid. Here is Benny Hinn, flashing his eye candy, the Illuminati sign, over and, over and, over again, the Judas Kiss. Here is the guest of Benny Hinn flashing his eye candy also. Here is Brothers of the Word Ministry flashing his eye candy, the Illuminati sign, over and over again, the Judas Kiss. He even flashes his eye candy while tied to a cross, paying straight out homage to his boss. Here is Brother Man of the Word again. And again, and again, flashing his eye candy as fast as he can, little gingerbread man. Dr. Todd Coons flashing his eye candy like a buffoon. The Illuminati sign. Here is Pastor Lance Watson flashing his eye candy. The Illuminati sign. Here we have Gregory Dickow flashing his eye candy. The Illuminati sign. Over and over again, the Judas Kiss. You cannot serve two masters, God and money. What many in the church has sold out to is a religious spirit and dollars set up by the Illuminati. Part one of five and moving on to part two.